guys welcome back to our mechanics thank you guys for watching subscribing to the channel guys in today's video guys we're going to discuss if you have a transmission codes guys so any of those three codes p0740 p0741 or p0742 guys and you have a chevy gmc or buick guys with the transmissions the following transmissions 60 30 60 35 60 40 60 45 guys stay with us we'll explain what could cause that we we'll guys have more than 200 videos on this car and every car and every engine and transmission that comes to the shop will be taken apart so we can guys provide as many videos as we can so you can we can save you quite a bit of money please guys in return subscribe give a like and drop a comment below let us know if the video was helpful we will also have a playlist for that transmission so please check it out on the channel guys we're trying to organize the video so it can be a little bit easier for you to find now if you guys get any of those three codes P0740, P0741 or P0742 we'll explain what could cause that they relate to the okay to the torque converter clutch guys as you know your torque converter this is the engine this is the transmission open here the torque converter is right between the transmission and okay and the engine where they connect that's where your torque converter is and they call that code sometimes the code of death because it means you have to remove the transmission replace the converter but not always guys that torque converter is uh, is controlled by a solenoid a solenoid is kind of like a switch that turns it on and off and this is guys your solenoids we have the video on the channel that completely explains how to replace them how to remove them and all that stuff this is just a quick video guys to show you that code now let me explain now guys you have generation 1 and generation 2 for those transmissions uh, they started making it I believe in 2008 all the way until recent 2019-20 models guys come with it as well and generation 1 and 2 okay differ by some solenoids but not all of them the middle one is a shifter solenoid generation 1 you will have all black solenoids generation 2 you will have powerful solenoids but the solenoid that is responsible for the torque converter should be the same place on generation 1 and 2. This is your shifter solenoid for the transmission. The other ones are pressure solenoids. But next to the shifter solenoid on the right facing this way, you can see this is the transmission here, computer. This solenoid right here guys, this is your torque converter clutch solenoid. So if you guys have any of those codes, it could be just that solenoid that needs to be replaced. You can test them, but even if you test them, doesn't mean that the solenoid is perfectly fine because it could malfunction, let's say, when the temperature, the, the transmission reaches higher temperature and then it starts malfunctioning or sticking or not closing and opening correctly. So this, guys, is the solenoid. We have the video how to replace it on the channel. Please check it out. So hopefully, guys, the video will be helpful to some of you. Please hit that subscribe button and see you guys next time.